Having uprooted themselves from their home countries to resettle in a foreign land, many domestic workers in Singapore find themselves lonely and homesick. However, finding a partner to spend time with is frowned upon by mates' employers, but that doesn't stop mates from finding company. Just only friendly eating, drinking, uh, uh, and the after work. I see on Sundays. Uh, yeah. Okay, so you meet her every Sunday? No, no, no. no. She's going uh, monthly one off, one time. So you meet her once every month. Yeah. Okay. Do you talk over the phone? Yeah, talk. Talk over the phone. Yeah. Huh? yeah. Okay. Sometimes. How long have you known each other? Uh, just only two months. About two months. Ah. Yeah. Uh. So, are you just friends, or are the two of you going to be boyfriend girlfriend? No. Yeah. We Not boyfriend. Just yeah. friends. Yeah. So is she your friend? Yeah. Friend. How do you know each other? Huh? How do you know her? Uh, yeah. People, my friend, uh, friend, friend. Friend introduce you. Ah, okay. So, but is she your girlfriend? Huh? Is she your girlfriend? No. no. <laughs> so y'all meet every Sunday? No, no, no. No? One month, two month, one time. Oh, one month, once a week. You mean you don't have girls coming to you and say let's be friends? Uh, my friend, people have that girl. Then talking to me, then talking. To me. No oh. need, no need go anywhere. No go hotel and you know. So they do come here and talk to you, only la. But you say no, no, no. I don't want to be your boyfriend. No need. <laughs> Why not? Aren't you lonely? Don't you want a girlfriend? No need money, no enough. Okay. You just met them. Oh, you just met them where? Yeah. Here on Archer Road. Yeah, here. At Lucky Plaza. So now you are friends, ah. Mm. So where are you going off to? Huh? Where are you going? going home. Oh, you're going back home. What about you? Huh? Where are you going? Now I want to go Mustafa. You're going to Mustafa, and you're going back home. And you're going back home. No, no, because this one I just get late only. Oh, first time. Oh. Okay. Okay. So come here and buy ice cream, lah. Okay. So who pay for the ice cream? Huh? <laughs> who pay for the ice cream? Ice cream. You pay. None of the couples Fraser TV spoke to admitted to being in a relationship. Some even denied knowing each other, even though they were spotted holding hands. But this is no surprise. Mates keep their relationships hush hush for fear of being repatriated back home. One popular argument put forth by Singapore employers against the mandatory day off is the fear that their mates will fall into bad company. Really, we don't know. We have uh, news on uh, mates. You know the recent one whereby the maid and the boyfriend was killed, was murdered in the Geylang Hotel and all this thing. I think we have to do a lot of counselling. That's my view. Uh. Uh, my previous maid have some. I don't. I think have some relationship with some Bangladesh. Yeah. Okay. Quite some time back already. Okay. Yeah. That's many years. Oh no! I just sent her back after you found out that. That's yeah, I just sent her back. Yes. Do you think that we can do more to protect these maids who don't know what they are up against? I don't know because uh, it's it's their life. It's their, it's their life. life. They choose. They choose. Yeah. So we can't. Can we protect them by keeping them at home? <laughs> ah, it seems like you're referring to a chicken. I have to put you in a cage. So you will be stay here forever safe. I'll just give you food, water, and everything you need. Sorry, I think my comment suicide. Yeah. Don't you feel lonely and maybe you want to find like a partner? Yeah, sometimes you feel lonely, but I don't really mind. I don't have a partner because I have, I have a family in in my in the house, right? My employer is my first family already oh. that I can talk to. Like like if I miss my children, then I have children to hug to, right? Uh, my employer's children. Next up, employers argue that they need their mates on Sundays to take care of the elderly and persons with disability at home. We explore that up next. <laughs>